the member for Torn Hill. Um, I, w I just want to say that the member from uh, Wellington Halton Hills really hit the nail on the head, and I think that that's what uh, we're really afraid of on the side of the House, is that uh, somehow this is going to be uh, used by the government. Uh, this pool of money is going to be used for infrastructure projects um, at low yields instead of investing in the highest yield possible because a pension is only worth um, the, what, how the investment grows. And the, uh, the member that just spoke opposite me who, who said that people want a guaranteed income in their retirement, of course they want a guaranteed income in our retirement, but people also want a guaranteed job with a guaranteed income during their time. And more and more we're hearing from business owners that this is going to actually take jobs out of the province. We're going to have higher unemployment rates, and those people who are not employed are not going to be part of this pension. So I think that uh, as a province, we really do have to focus on the economy. We have to focus on cutting red tape, on creating more jobs, on cutting down the deficit, cutting down the debt. And uh, yes, as uh, the member from Wellington Halton Hills said, that maybe when Ontario shows that it can be the leader of the Canadian economy once again, that maybe our federal counterparts uh, will be willing to discuss a simplified um, pension scheme, which is one pension working together that is topped up by Ontario as opposed to two separate pensions and somehow trusting this government not to raid the piggy bank um, in order to fund projects because they don't have the revenue stream because of the high debt costs. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker.